All right, welcome back to episode, I think this is episode six of Tavern Master with Sir Stubby. I'm Sir Stubby, and this is our tavern. And uh, last episode, we got our second floor done, which was kind of nice, kind of cool. Here we are, right at the start of a new day. Yeah, last episode, we got this done. We got new longer tables. We still got to get the bar, and I think we're going to leave the kitchen open this time. If we can, I don't know the the laws of <laughs> medieval taverns, but uh, yeah. And we also did our first big event. We did a battle event. We did one of these uh, right here, battle victory celebration. We need to get more beans and we can do it again. What other ones can we do? I think we can almost do this one down here now. We need to get meat. So these guys need to like pick it up. We can't even get to 240, I don't think. Even with all these guys. Okay, we can only get to 37. Well, we'll send them to get some fish. Oh my god, for 810? That's not worth my time. We do need strawberries. We do need some beans. Some crates are missing ingredients on floor one. This is looking excessively full. I don't, I <laughs> don't know what else they want from me here. Oh, there's this crate here. I didn't even see this one over here. I forgot we put this in. I didn't know we had fruits and vegetables. Damn it. Now we're just going to owe more money every day. It's hard being a, a tavern master. Sir Stubby's good at power washing. He's good at house flipping. And he's good at just being alive and being a nobleman. You know? He's great at being a nobleman. He's also great at running a gas station, which is... Oh man, we took a massive loss. Which is way harder than running a tavern, I would say. I don't know. I don't know in real life, but I'm assuming we get to level this up. Let's just get all this going. Let's make some money. Oh, this is an event. Okay, so we're going to earn... This event kind of doesn't earn us a lot of money, but uh, it's good just to get, get it done, you know? Oh, we can do this one. Whatever. We'll do the executioner's meetup. It'll be super dark. <laughs> okay, what are we researching here? We're researching the light bulb, which is kitchen items level two and we're doing good we're doing good ladies and gentlemen this event this event doesn't make us a lot of money so we're just gonna skip to the end of it all right the event is done we uh netted 194 like i said doesn't make us a lot of money that one in fact it costs us more money <laughs> to do it than it does anything these guys should be back with some of our stuff here well we got 33 that time all right they need to go right back out and get us some more beans we'll get them going here in a minute all right i think it's time to up up our beer prices change prices increase there we go back down to 191 it'll piss some people off but we're not in this business for poor people <laughs> they want a drink they can go get some water it's free in fact it's right here we want all the wealthy people in our tavern refill our water for free see it's free and we'll give you some lemonade i will just give you full oh well, let's get let's prepare the kitchen future expansion here all right there we go as we are we're currently working on a level two or the kitchen i also think that the the, the kitchen staff would like a window to look out oh <laughs> then they can see like oh no there's too many customers or oh man that guy Greg's back right into their food. <laughs> Good old medieval loogie right into the food, you know? <laughs> uh, if you can't laugh, what can you do, ladies and gentlemen? Light plant, light plant, light plant, light plant. That's looking good. Okay, we need to make sure these are on the... The non burn the floor one. Perfect. There's no fire extinguisher on floor two. Oh, we can put that fire extinguisher up. Done. Okay, that solves that warning. But I think we're doing okay. We might even be able at the end of this day put more tables upstairs. Like I said in the last episode, only upstairs is going to be 100% complete when the time comes. Okay, so menu. Okay, any angry customers? Zero left angry. Perfect. Okay, so no courses only desserts tomorrow start new day we spent six hundred dollars just to <laughs> start today but that's okay because that gives us money to go buy some tables here oh <laughs> we get to buy a table <laughs> okay what's our new challenge serve only main course see like damn you this is an event day so this is a no profit day so it's a perfect time to invest in very <laughs> expensive tables and rug. Hey, we're up to six tables total for upstairs. All right, let's get this event done.
All right, big profit day. Any angry customers? Zero left angry. Start the next day. Uh oh, I guarantee we're getting robbed this time. No, he's running. Got to hire more guards. Okay, what are you guys stealing? Oh my, you guys are just taking everything. Okay. That's unfortunate. We immediately have to replace those barrels. That so was, uh, has the wine and the ale refill and we have to hire another guard. That's for sure. Hire. <laughs> I want Rob to stop the robbers. <laughs> oh, what? I can't hire another guard. Why not? This gets screwed up. Okay. Well then we need to upgrade our guard. He needs an upgrade. A bigger sword. <laughs> All our profits just stolen in one night. That's the worst. Buy a new barrel of wine. Done. Well, that's a nice looking recipe. <laughs> Make a profit. These two guys just come up, swing their sword. Our guard just runs. They didn't even hit him. They just swung his sword and he's just like, nope, I'm out. Bye. <laughs> oh my God. We'll let these guys clean up. There we go. I love how it's like 8 a.m. and these people are in here ready to get hammered. <laughs> that's wine. <laughs> Start the day. And she cries. <laughs> oh, so tomorrow is going to be our event day. We're negative 300. Yeah, so it's the event day today. Executioners. Every single one of these guys, their job <laughs> is to kill people. And they're all in one room. <laughs> they just They just execute. That's their job. And they're all in one room just eating dinner together. Like, yeah, <laughs> we do it. We kill people. <laughs> oh, man. All right. We get to open up our menu again, I think. No, this is doing good, actually. We get to open our menu back up for tomorrow. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. The Executioner's Dinner or ball or whatever you want to call it is done. We did it. That was our first time doing that event. I think we did all right. Our soups are done. We leveled that soup up. Hey, we need to get some walnuts. Oh my God. It's going to take everyone to go climb a tree. <laughs> uh, own 51 benches. We just need one more table and we did that. We did, we're done the table one, so we'll just get that done. There you go. That completes this. We're up to 247. I think we can raise beer prices again. Change prices. Increase. Oh, that's going to hurt me. Okay, we're doing it. Okay, so we took... We were at 240 guests per day. We're, now we're down to 163. That's a big drop. That's almost 100. And apparently we're missing food. There you go. You're all stocked. We need coconuts. We also need one of these to get to level four. It's taking a long time. Oh, we got some legendaries in here today. So I think we continue up here with our, our original plan here. This is the hanging vines level. So this level's coming along. It's looking nice up here. This is going to be like the banquet hall. That's what we're going to call it. Banquet floor. Oh, <laughs> that's our biggest lost ever. And this is our, oh, come on. I got you a new sword. Yes. Negative 844. Okay. So this is also probably going to be a loss because remember we, um, we raised our prices. Why is this in the middle of the room? We got no events coming up. We can do a uh, work anniversary, which is a hundred of those. We need this. The battle celebration. We'll follow that up with, we have no chicken. We need wal walnuts. We need to focus on getting walnuts with our explorers. Do this one too. We've never done that one. Can we plan another one this week? No. Big event day. It's a battle day here in Sir Stubby's Tavern. We won a battle that was completely based off of whether or not we held this event. And since that we held the event, the enemy team, the enemy team, the enemy army was like, no. We retreat, you win, enjoy your party. Okay? 
enjoy it. And that's what they're here to do. This will help us complete this light bulb, which then gives us all these other branches that we get to do. Hotel, barrel storage, which I'm thinking is for the drinks. Another kitchen, which will be good for upstairs because we can add another bar. Um, that was somewhere over here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Right here, one more bar. So once we can uh, add more barrel storage, then we'll open the other bar because we barely keep this one stocked. Then we get a hotel, the kitchen. But this is what our goal for the episode is today. Finish this. Then we can carry on down here because none of this looks that hard once you start getting going, right? Unlimited bars, extra 28 legendary guests a day. Toilets. Yeah, I never thought of that. <laughs> Where are these guys going to the washroom? Oh man, you must get a lot of fires near the end. And then the last thing is just uh, games. And then we'd win. We're about halfway done this game. Look at this. Speeding through and one more. Done. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. We gained a ton of money. Might as well restock this scene so we're right here. Refill. A ton of money earned. That was a good event. That was a good event. I'm glad we won that war. Now, if only I could get these guys, the adventures to get me more nuts. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please hit that like button. Maybe give me a comment and consider maybe subscribing. If not, that's fine. I'm Sir Stubby. This is my tavern. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.